everything wrong in dating a guy who's just cheap, stingy, gross. Stop dating cheap guys. Is he showing you the cheapest menu options saying that's the most delicious? Is he counting how many drinks you have? Is he not willing to send you an Uber when you're coming over to his place? Let me clarify, there's nothing wrong in dating a guy that is on the path to financial freedom. But there's everything wrong in dating a guy who's just cheap, stingy, gross. Stop. And there's everything wrong with any man that sees himself being with you. And that's a fact. You and women like you have ruined the dating marketplace. You and women like you with this feminist ideology has ruined the dating market. You have taken feminist, the, the whole feminist movement and just completely destroyed its original meaning to benefit you. And you've destroyed the dating marketplace. Women just like you. But guess what? There's also women that turn 18 every single day. That look better than you. That are not tainted like you. Have less bodies than you. Look better than you. Have better bodies than you. Has a better character than you. Every single day. And yet you ladies like you run around wondering why men prefer ladies between 18 to 24. When you poll men around the world, 18 to 24, you wonder why that is. Because men don't want to deal with ungrateful, self-entitled women like you. That only focus on what a man has and not who he is. Because you don't want nobody to focus on who you are. So why would you care about focusing on who the man is? Respecting who he is. It's all about take, 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 take. But what are you offering? What do you bring? Where's your value? What is your value, rather? What is your character? Because to me, it seems like just take, 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 take. Men don't owe you anything. And again, fellas... Don't give a woman anything she doesn't deserve because she's not going to respect you. You're going to always be, in, be playing catch up. Whatever you do is never going to be enough. She's always going to want more. Instead, get with a woman that wants you when you have nothing. Because like women like to say all the time, if she didn't want you when you had nothing, she don't need you or deserve you when you have everything. Stop going on these cheap dates. Stop going to Chili, stop going to Applebee's. Stop dealing with men that, that take you out on these cheap dates like this. Two for 20 meals, that's pathetic. Just as pathetic as that two for 20 deal you got on that hair wave. It's pathetic. Do you know why these type of men do this? They say, well, we're interviewing these women. I ain't trying to spend all my money. But they don't have any money. They don't have any money anyway. So what are they what are they losing? Thirty dollars? Forty dollars? Bye, have a good night. I don't care if it's one dollar. It's not your money. It's his. Stop going on these cheap dates. You might as well just stay home, baby. Stay home. And disappear. Don't even text him back. Cause he's pathetic. And see, that type of advice right there will keep you staying at home, keep you single, keep you lonely. And unfortunately, a lot of women want other women to be single, especially if they're not happy themselves. That's just the bottom line, folks. Is that, is that all it is? It's just that it's a chain restaurant? No, it's cheap. That's what I keep telling okay, you. Okay, well, I have, I have a rule, right, where I'm not going to take anyone on the first I don't care about your rule. Any guy has never had a problem with taking me anywhere I want to go, so why do you have a problem? Stop lying. You know that there's a lot of men that will have a problem with you acting like that. It's probably one of the reasons why you're single.
And you have a problem because you found you sound very entitled, very stuck up. I'm not entitled. I just know my worth, and my worth is not Olive Garden. Like clearly, like uh, do I look me, like me, Olive Garden? Let me, let me guess. You, you guys standards? You guys yeah. Standards? Like who? Everyone should have standards. Like what is that about? What is Olive Garden Look, about? It's like, not standards. That's just being stuck up and like. But like, you see the way that I'm dressed. You see, you saw the way that I'm dressed when you brought me here. Like at yes, this point, it's low-key disrespectful. You notice how women tend to. Uh, equate their value to how they're dressed, everything on the exterior, uh, materialistic type of things, but yet they say nothing about their character. See, it's okay for them to look good on, on the outside and have all that together, but their character can be whatever they choose it to be. And this particular woman right here, her character is ungrateful. You got me these cheap grocery store flowers? Like, you're, you're at this point, you're disrespecting Yes, you're disrespecting me. Like, why would you bring me here? Like, do I... You didn't have to get any flowers at all. See, guys, this is another reason why you should never give women things that they don't deserve. They don't respect that, and they won't respect you. You look like I eat all Garden. Like, be for real. You look like you eat whatever you want to eat, just like everybody else. That is a dumb question to even ask. I brought you here because it's a restaurant. It's a chain. I mean, look here. If you have a problem with Olive Garden, we could go to IHOP right over there. IHOP? Yeah. Why are you even trying to bounce her across the street to IHOP? She's already disrespected you. She doesn't deserve anything. Uh, what what? Is, like what? It's a restaurant. Like it's, it's not it's, even breakfast time. Why would I want to eat? It breakfast doesn't even right matter. It, like, it's it's a chain restaurant. It's yes. a chain restaurant. Exactly. But it's a restaurant. That's the key it's point. Like it's like fast a food. It's, it's not fast food. Fast food. Yes, it is. Look, if I took you to a McDonald's, I'd understand you being pissed off. But like, this is not McDonald's. This might. You know what? McDonald's has nothing to do with it. You shouldn't give women things that they don't deserve. If a woman equates her attraction towards you towards how much or based on how much money you spend on her even if it's just a dollar that's a problem that means she's not genuine she's definitely not genuinely interested in you she doesn't really care about you she just cares about what you're going to give her and you know what you can provide and when you start out getting to know someone on this type of standard this is what she's going to expect the whole time so don't be weak and try to buy yourself buy your way into a woman's affections it never works and again she's not going to respect you even though she will take everything you give her it doesn't mean she respects it she never will well be. this is like 30 dollars a plate this might as well be it's not 30 dollars a plate it might as well be okay like, i don't know what you order but when i order 30 dollars a plate you can get some nice food here Okay. I, 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 I'm, I'm not eating here. That's all I'm saying. That's why I'm not eating. I'm not getting out the car and I'm not eating here. Like, okay. what don't you understand? Okay. Like, yeah, uh, if you got a problem with it, uh, you can get out of my car. No, I'm not getting out. Take me home. You. Oh, wait. Spend money to take you home now? Spend more money? He already spent money in gas or, you know, his electricity or whatever he's done to get you there. You're ungrateful and now you want him to spend money to take you home? Can get out. I'm not getting out. Just get in the car and take me I, home. I'm not going to take you anywhere. I don't even know where I am, and you're just going to make me get out? Uh, you can call an Uber. You don't know where you are, but you chose to have an attitude, but you don't know where you are? Like he's supposed to care about that? You have GPS. I'm sure you have the iPhone, the newest one. Go call an Uber. Because if money's not an issue, I mean, yeah, you can get an Uber. I'm Are not you serious right now? <laughs> yeah, I'm dead serious. I'm not going to drive you anywhere. Well, you can keep your cheap flowers. I don't want them. I'll figure it out. Okay. Yeah, I don't you need can. to. Yeah. Because you brought me here. Like, what What was the point of that? Yeah, no. Like, um, what's your problem? You have a great rest of your day. Like, um, you could just leave. I am leaving. Bye. Bye. Yeah, he's going to leave without you and leave your ungrateful behind in that parking lot where you belong. Cause you really think that you're all that and you're average at best. Let's just call it what it is. See ladies, you can dress all good, smell good, be sexy, all that. But your character is what matters.